nice to spend time with the family, but I'd rather be at an auction. Alright guys, I'm here walking around. Favorite part, seeing what kind of deals, auctions. As you can see, you'll see everything. Anything and everything you can imagine, you're going to see that auction. Um, one of the key tips of the day for you is as you're making that you're walking around it's important to look things up to make sure you're buying what you want but at the same time people are watching you everything you look at they see you looking at it and if you spend too much time looking at any particular item you may catch somebody else's attention so i'd have different tricks that work for me like i might take a picture or I might just keep coming back to an item and memorizing what the, the part number or the name is. And then I'll look it up on my phone. But this is my favorite part of auction, which is kind of stressful. But it's when I like to walk around and see what's there. And see if I can get some treasures. Alright folks, this vacuum right here is what I got my eye on. It's a Letra Lux. Really got my eye on it. We'll see what happened. Also have my eye on a typewriter over there. I don't want to stay too long. The car is packed, but we'll see what happens today. Oh, yeah, I love the stairs as I'm doing this. All right. Let's see here. I'm just saying, there's a ton of things here. I'm going to start listing them on the videos of what sells. But this typewriter here, I'm definitely looking at this one. We'll see what happens. All right, guys, I got this Electrolux here. It's the vacuum I wanted to get. I paid a little bit more for it than I wanted to. I paid 32 and a half for it. I want my instincts. It was a good call. Uh, it'll get listed for about 120, give or take. Um, let's see here. Electrolux is their old school vacuums. They, people buy them, they spend a lot of money. They last forever. Um, the vintage ones always sell. The used ones always sell and it's very rare that they do not work still and even when they don't work you can sell them for um parts so or you could piece it out but here you go i got the vacuum i was trying to get today 32 and a half for that all right i did it i got that typewriter i wanted I paid ten dollars for it this typewriter is a royal um conservatively at least a hundred dollars i paid ten for it um, while I was walking out the door, I just bought this uh, fire, old firefighter suit. Paid 16 for it. We won't list it for less than 60 or 80. I always get my money back on the firefighter suits. So, um, yep, there we go. This is my mirror. All right, folks. I just wanted to try to go through things as I'm buying them, sort of try and catch up at once. These old horse mirrors setups. This isn't exactly what I thought it was. A little disappointed in it. I should have researched it more before I got it. But regardless, I paid 19 for it, and it will sell for an easy 50. I'm positive on that on Etsy at least um, Girl Scout patches I paid three dollars for this bundle of them very easy 40 to 50 in patches I've always done good in Girl Scouts boy Scout patches uh, these alabaster these two alabaster um, dishware three alabaster and one throwing I paid a dollar each for those 
easy, easy, easy uh, $25 a piece. Uh, they always sell on Etsy. You can tell that they're alabaster. When you get a, you start to get a feel for it, and then a lot of times it'll say they're alabaster on the back. These old cufflinks, these are swank cufflinks. Easy money in the bank. I just bought them, the whole lot of them for like $2. That's an easy $20 to $30 sale online. This seller is a lot, move them quickly. This here, I'm keeping, because my wife, I, I learned not to throw away anything. My wife always, like stuff that, you know, I don't know about, and there's value in it. So something like this little hair piece thing, don't throw it away, research it. And there's a silver necklace in it, a 925 silver necklace that just happened to be in a lot. So that's that's for today so far, where I'm at. All right, guys, that's a wrap for today. Time to get something to eat. Um, spent about $90 today. Made about, uh, about 500 on top of that. Um, now it's time to go get something to eat. Remember to like and subscribe to this video. Come back for more.